a beautiful time with you again on our farm. Let's check out our male bunnies. We have only two female, sorry, our male rabbits. We have only two female rabbits here that we are making ready to for breeding. We are making ready for breeding. You can see this beautiful lion head rabbit, and it's really, really doing well. It's really, really. You can see for yourself. Our rabbits are doing well, well, very well. Okay, so let's feed them. Please bring me food. Bring me food. Let's continue from the other video. Bring me food. Today we are feeding them with same. Let me check. Is it okay? It's two. Oh, you are hungry. Ow, ow, ow. Sorry. All right, let's go. Go back, go back, go back and get your food. Go back and get your food. Yeah, so that's it for this beautiful female rabbit. Are they not looking nice? Are they not beautiful? Oh. <laughs> All right, so yeah, they're enjoying their food now. So let's move from them and um, let's go to this rabbit. This rabbit here is the one we use in doing the crossing for the, if you remember the video we showed you that a rabbit we crossed on the 17th gave birth on the se 2nd of the next month. So let's say if we crossed it on the June, yes, we crossed it on June 2nd and it gave birth on July 17th, which is not supposed to be that way. Sorry, is it? No, June 2nd. June 17th and it gave birth on July 2nd. It was supposed to be either June, June 17th to July 17th or 18th, between 18th and 19th. Yes, but then we crossed it on the 17th and it gave birth on the 2nd of July. And this is the magic rabbit. We are still looking to it. We don't know what happened. We don't know. Like, we don't know if we made a mistake. But, yeah. So this is the rabbit that crossed that um, female. But you can see the eye. There's something white on it. Um, check this one. You can see this one is black. And you can see a little white in there but the other side has something on it um we are we are treating it it's something that came on it and we are working on it to go yeah you can see check it out you see and this is not how it is and this is not how it's supposed to be so we are working on it so let's feed it let's feed it it's doing very well and i like the offspring it brought out and you saw it in our video and we will still update you on um, the other subsequent ones. So go back and take your food. Go back. Yeah. Yeah. Take your food. Mm -hmm. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Ouch. It's a lion hair. Not, not a full breed, but a half breed. The mother is a lion head rabbit. And the mother is here. We showed the mother to you. And um, I think. Oh, <laughs> I made a mistake. The mother is not a lion head. The mother is a normal breed. And the, the father is a lion head rabbit. Okay, so let's move to our next room. Um, this is the almighty father of all the rabbits we have here. So this is the male we started with. We we started with um, two females and a male. Started with two females and a male, and this is the male, the father, the boss himself. So this is the one we started with, and uh, Charlie, it has really helped the farm. This rabbit has, though we've been doing um, 
crossing outside the farm but this rabbit really really um puts like a much effort in doing most of the breedings we have here so we love it and let's feed it thank you thank you so much go back thank you for bringing a good luck to our farm we've not recorded any bad news and we pray it continues this way for us all day every day yeah thank you mm. so one thing is you see you can see we have um two feeders in their cages all of them you can see two feeders here you can see two feeders here you know we have this thing here this um box um this container here that we used to put water inside and you can see the um passage pipe that the water passes through and enters their cages okay but unfortunately for us the this thing if air blows and it touches the cage like this you see that they will use their mouth to chew the rubber so let me go down so you see what i'm talking about down down here and it cut from here okay so the top it's cut and we have joined them so there are holes in there that when we put water in you will see that it will it will it will leak you get it and all the water will pour out that is why we have placed in the um, feeders to give them water and food but as time goes on we will use a plastic pipe to create the uh, water passage into their um, cages so that they will have access to their water because the plastic pipe they can't chew the plastic pipes and i think that is going to really help the farm a lot so when we place the water in here it will run through all the cages so when we put we will get a bigger container because there are many now so we will put water in there and then uh, it will flow through all the cages and it's really going to help we and it's going to save time it's going to help us and it's going to save time yeah so from here let's move to this is our magical rabbit this is our magical rabbit i'll show you a picture of this rabbit this rabbit here had its skin off when it was like two months it grew with its skin and when it was two months the skin went totally off nothing to show it was skin like um like that this thing went off at all and we didn't see any um fair fairs on it but god being so good we were we lost the hope of it um growing to become nice like this but so far so good charlie charlie it amounts to humans okay don't don't see yourself as a uh, nobody today you may be down tomorrow it may help you be you'll be the best of town to talk about okay you'll be the best to talk about in town so never give up this is this is a motivational <laughs> message on our farm we are giving to you today so this rabbit i'll show you i'll really really show you and you you understand why we are happier for this uh, rabbit so let's feed it let's um give it um food now and uh, yeah we will move and move and move and move sorry i love you mm. oh by you what's up we have given you food and you want to parasite Hey, why? Hey, Asemu. See them. <laughs> okay. Okay. So let's move to the next cage. Okay, so we use this also as. We have used this one too for breeding and it's really doing well it's really doing well. let's feed it let's feed it we don't have enough time to 
not too much for it. <coughs> yeah. Because we will feed you again, so just enjoy this one. So this they are always fighting. Because we are we have shortage of cages. We are managing them in one cage for now. They are always fighting. They are siblings though, but they are always fighting. You can uh, let me see which one is hurt. See the eye. Where are you? Show the eye. Uh -huh, see the eye. It has hurt it, and we are planning to take it off the cage. It's always trying to cross itself, and it's really hurting each other. So we will take, we will take, we will separate them soon, and make them have their freedom. Yeah, we'll separate them soon and let them have their freedom. Yeah. Yeah, so basically, today that's the video we are showing to you on here. And I hope you enjoyed it. So, as you can see this container here, because... Um, down here we have only metals if we remove this one let me, let me do this i think i showed this video some time ago but so those of us who want to do a story a story building like cage um look at how it looks like when we remove this one like this you can see it has a hole in there that it will come So you can see it has a, 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 a hole under here that it can poo poo and wee wee on this one. Okay, it can poo poo and wee wee on this one. So what we will do is um, we just place this one. Check it out. You see the cage. Yeah, so what we do is to just put this plates under it so that when it poo poo and it wee wee it will go down 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 there we just drilled a hole at the back side two corners of this plate so when this one wee wee it goes into this and it passes through that side and comes down 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 into this bowl into this bowl so this one also has a plate under when it will be inside it goes down there when this one also will be it passes through this plate and go like oh that is how we have made it even a wooden cage that is it okay so it goes down down and because the hole is here to drill the hole through to that side let me just put it so you see the hole so that's the hole that's the hole so it will go down 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 so sometimes you see how the cage inside the plate inside is you use that all then we put the dirt all inside this plate to make it um so that animals will not enter the um, plates okay to make it neat and small good so yeah that is it so it will go down 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 here and it enters into this bowl we will take out this bowl and then go and put it on our plants and it serves as a manure to our plants as well so we are not wasting their um, waste parts their um, their feces and their urine we are making use of them and it's really helping so I think I'll say God bless you for watching and um, thank you for being part of this um, rabbit farming and um, we are growing together we will keep updating you and showing you lots and lots. Keep asking questions. Keep sharing your ideas. Let us know what you think we can do to help this farm so that we grow and grow well. Okay. Yes. Um, if you need any any rabbit, um, you can contact us at 244 721 and we are ready to serve you. Either for meat, for pets, for um, breeding purposes. We are here to serve you right okay we will show you lots and lots of our rabbits we have them here as you can see 
we have them we have them we have them lots of them in here okay different different ones of them so and we have some here as well we have some here check we have some here and uh, we have a grass cutter but the grass cutter i will show you i will do a video of the grass cutter for you to see some other type okay you can see our grass cutter they are very very big and we have them all stuck in one cage like one building inside here so i'll show you the grass cutters um some other time for you to have a look at old boy is really doing well on the farm and charlie we are also supporting so this is it thank you for watching subscribe be part of us and let's learn together no one is perfect there are things i know we are not doing right you can share with us so that we correct them so that we don't have any challenges on our farm okay thank you so much for watching let's say it's a bye for now let's uh, meet some other time on this page to have fun thank you subscribe comment share with family and friends to encourage someone to do farming bye